Hello and welcome to episode 51 of my Force of Nature tutorial Let's Play series. This episode will be on making a metal mortar and iron pan. Two things that will each boost my cooking by 30% each. So a total of 60% quicker cooking. How cool is that? I want to dedicate this episode to Multiface Channel for making me the most wonderful channel art. It really is a work of art and so perfect. Thank you so very much MFC. It uh, is a perfect addition to my channel. So lovely, kind and sweet of you. Thank you. Okay, moving on. So time to speed up our cooking. Let's get to it. Okay, now this is going to involve the crafting table, but it's going to benefit the cooking table. So let's bring up the crafting table and take a look what we need. You'll notice that I have made a metal mortar just to save a little time in the crafting. Um, let's bring up the recipes however and take a look at what we're going to need. So for the metal mortar you need one iron ingot and one bronze ingot. For the iron pan you're going to need two iron ingots. So let's go grab a couple of iron ingots. Okay, so there's our iron. Let's go make ourselves a metal pan. Or an iron pan, I should say. So here we go. Let's select that and click OK. Right, so while that's crafting, remember I put a hammer in there, so it is a bit 30% quicker now. Um, can't wait for my cooking to speed up tremendously as well, although I must try to find out where I can make a knife. Uh, there must be an upgrade for the knife that I've missed, perhaps. Uh, that's definitely going to be something I want to do to speed up this crafting table. Uh, maybe it's somewhere else an upgrade for the knife I'll get, I'm guessing I'll find it eventually ok so that's nearly done there we go, cool let's take it and now let's put these new tools in our cooking table I'm going to need two obviously one set for this table, one set for that table so let's open it up and drop the components inside. There we go. Now let's demonstrate this by making a hundred coffee. Why not? So to make a hundred coffee I believe we need 500 um, coffee branches. Let's go to cooking, recipes and there's a good old coffee can never have enough coffee, let's select that. Oh, wait a minute, what am I misfiguring here? Ah, water, I need water. I've got enough beans, uh, coffee branches. Let's grab a hundred water. Okay, coffee. And 100. Okay, so this now is going to go through much 60% quicker than it has been up till now. So that is really fantastic because I used to have to, for flour and coffee. Um, I know I've got chocolate, the option of chocolate, but um, I still just prefer the coffee. Don't ask me why. I just love coffee in real life, coffee in force of nature. So I'm just sticking with that for a bit. But look at this, so, so much quicker. That is absolutely fantastic. Okay, so I'm going to leave that cooking. And what I'm going to do is go over to my junk pile. Well, all right, okay, it's a massive junk pile, but a specific tall junk pile of outused tools. Let's just throw them all there. 
and let's grab some more honey you can never have enough honey I do like apple pies and yes I'm making sure that I've got a hundred in reserve uh, apart from the hundred that I have so I'm just getting loads of honey, water, coffee branches, sugar, flour, everything I could possibly need. Okay, you can see here I've got stacks of sugar now. I'm getting stacks of honey, I've got stacks of flour. I even got stacks of butter for my pocket lanterns. Um, apples, making sure that I've got plenty of them. Because um, if we look at the apple pies, so yeah, check. Got loads of that, loads of that, loads of that. It's all good. Right. Anyway, with the remainder of the time I've got left in this episode, let's go do some hunting. Now I won't take no chances. I will throw down what I've spent ages gathering, like so. The rest. I'm not fussed if I lose. I'll throw my wheat down, I guess. That's always useful to have loads of wheat. Okay, let's go do some travelling and see if it can become daylight. And we will take a trip to Vega. Now, actually, I was going to do another portal, I think. Let's go and have a look. Where had I got to? Yeah, so I'm in the realm of another portal. So let's go do that. I'm going to need 5 ash, 10 clay, 10 sand and 10 stone. Look at that, I can even remember I've made that many. So we want 5 ash. Got the stone, so it's just sand and clay. You can see I've been busy. So. Ten of that. And ten of that. Okay, let's just check. Because I'm not usually right. If I've got a choice between right and wrong, it's usually the wrong. But in this case, I've got it right. Right, okay, let's now go and see if we can make a little progress and make another portal. So we go to Vega. Switch to my mace, because no doubt I'm going to need it. And let's see if I can remember the way I went. Oh, here's someone all ready to join me. And it looks like they've all respawned. And as you oh, lovely, that was an onyx chip. Beautiful. Now, as you can see, I've made tons of stones, so that's just perfect. glowing ember. Cool. Okay, so am I going the right way? I thought I'd, yeah, this is the right way. Which is east. To 
just basically follow the trail of lamps and logs. I'm getting tons of chips now. I've got about five emerald chips and about ten onyx. So it's going really well with regards to getting the chips. I can definitely make another amulet of my choice now. Oh, we're going to have a bit of fighting here. Oh, it's one of them leading reapers. Okay, apple pie time. Oh, thank goodness for that. Them reapers just munch through your health. Right, okay, so we got some coins, some ash. Always good to get ash. Love getting the ash, just don't love fighting them grim reapers. But they will get easier as I go. Okay, let's check the map. So I've got to go a bit further before I can place a portal. So it looks like I headed south here for some reason. No, that's going back. That's the wrong direction. I need to go in this direction. Oh, let's eat some more Russells. Get my health back up. Yeah, I've got this big canyon, which is why I think I had to go around it. Oh yeah, here we go. So you can see where I've been going. Oh, another goblin. Ah, now Laura asked me to tame um, one of the higher level goblins. So let's give that a go. Because I would like to show you, Laura, uh, the effect that they have. But though he's run off. Let's see if I can find where he went. Did he go? How weird. He knows I'm going to tame him, that's why. Or try to tame him. How peculiar, he's just disappeared. Oh, there he is. Okay, so what level is he? Uh, I guess I'll find out. That's, whoops. There's one. There's two. And I should have done what Llewellyn said as well. Hit it a bit uh, to weaken it. Try and tame it, see if it's easier. There we go, and tamed. And he's level 9 goblin, so that's good. Good job that I didn't hit him. He's, I should have hit him straight away, maybe one hit, but I didn't want to kill him. I shall have to remember to try that as well. Anyway, so right, let's get him to follow me. Let's switch back to my mace. And let's see, where am I? Ah, so this is a good place for me, Nelly, to do a portal. In fact, I could go a bit more over here. Let's have a look. So, yeah, this is looking good. Let's chop all of this down. Looks like my goblins got stuck. So he's following me. Let's chop this down. Let's see if we can push a bit more the, to the east before placing this portal. Oh, 
Oh, there's the timer. But I'm not going to end this episode yet. If you wish to stop the video, you can. But I want to progress just a little further east. Why does it always get dark when the timer goes? Is it trying to tell me something? Okay. Yeah, this is a rather good place to have my portal on because I'm out of time. It's also a good idea that I do it. Let's put down some lamps. I'm wondering if I'm going to have the outer place the portal. Let's chop some more of these down. Looks like we're now entering a different biome. Yeah, this is definitely a different biome. I don't know if it's going to start having an adverse effect on me. But it's that direction I've got to keep going anyway let's place a portal see if I can do a portal here hmm doesn't want to let me yet uh, let's progress a bit further then See if it will let me place a portal after clearing this little area. Okay, let's see if I can do a portal. No. No, I'm going to have to keep chopping. Ah, maybe it will let me make one over here. Yonder. Yeah, map loading. And a bit of fighting coming up. Oh, can't squeeze through there. Let's do that tree, because the bush will keep a small, thin path. Let's see if my goblin gets stuck in. That's it, Mr. Gob. Ah, there we go. Cool. Oh, another... Oh, amethyst chips. We definitely are in a new zone. So that now looks like what we're getting. And what's that in the top right corner? It looks like a bear. And I'm imagining that they're all level 10 creatures now. Let's try and build a portal. No, not a barrel. I said a portal. Yep, here we go. Cool. Is that where I want it? Yeah. Let's do it before. Oh, that's a spirit. I've not seen one of them before. Shall we give it a try? Oh, yeah. Why not? So it's not attacking me. Though I shan't attack it. 
Look at that. Just floating through the, all the trees and woodland. What about this bear? I hope they don't kill my goblin. He's probably going to be high level. Oh, he's level 10. That other one's attacking my goblin. But it's distracting it from attacking me. So you can see how fantastic they are. I would have probably I would have died then if it hadn't have been for that goblin. Goblins are without a doubt fantastic. You gotta get yourself tame a goblin up. They will save your life just like mine was saved then. Right, okay, so we've got this new amazing biome to explore. I shall end this episode here and we'll have a lot more fun in the next episode. Uh, see what else we've got to make. Oh, and it looks like there's a new type of plant. Oh, blue roses. So it's all good, my friends. New biome, new plants, new creatures, and still a ton of new stuff for us to make. Wherever you are in the world, God bless you, and keep every last one of you safe. Thank you for watching, and have a fantastic day. Goodbye.